The CQ NRL bid has revealed its first jersey. The playing strip will be worn by the consortium's junior development squad. They play their first games this weekend when they take on Brisbane's Wavell High and Kibra Park of the Gold Coast. They only met on Friday, but the bid's first team already looks like a slick unit. Oh, good no one really knew each other, but the, everyone's gelled really together and uh, I'm really impressed with the, the quality of the team that we've got together. The NRL bid started the program to begin the on- and off-field development of promising players from the region. Uh, well, we're trying to equip them um, with the best skills possible and the best training possible to make them better players. The three-day training camp is all the boys get before they represent the club wearing its inaugural jersey this weekend. I mean, it's not so much about results, but it's improving the individuals as players. Uh, we want to take them through to be our first under-20 side um, in the NYC. The program is part of the continuous push to introduce an NRL team to the region. Oh, I'd mean a lot. Of it's, uh, it'd be a big thing. It'd be good for the region. Local product and former Australian player Matt Singh has been in similar shoes to these players. That's why he's such a strong supporter of the bid. At the end of my career, you know, the closest place I could come to is North Queensland to, to get home to my, to my family and be close. To... The team gets together again on Friday to head south for games in Brisbane and the Gold Coast. They'll be competitive, even though we've only been together for this weekend, but um, we're hopefully going to put a um, good showing out down there. Can't wait to kick their butts, <laughs> kick Brisbane's butts. Nathan Brooks, 7 News. Jerseys look great, don't they? They do. Wavell and Kibra, though. Tough ask first up. Yeah, we wish right. them well. Get on, <laughs> you boys.